sick with the hood off. All the turbo flutter. So we got the uh, street selects, the ET streets in the bed, uh, heading down to PIR with the boys. Should be a good time, do a little drag racing. Hopefully not break anything. Ran this truck down the quarter mile bone stock, and now it's time to see what it does with the turbo. Quick rundown on the truck for those of you that haven't seen this thing. So we got a bone stock V6, uh, 4.3 Vortec. Basically all this thing has is the marine intake manifold. It has a 450 pump in the tank. It's got 60 pound injectors and a turbo on about 15 pounds of boost. Uh, the V6 4.3 Vortec is bone stock, no valve springs, no cam, no, no head bolts, like bone stock, 170K. eBay GT35 turbo, uh, straight pipe, three inch, and it's got a five-speed manual transmission, the NV3500, eBay clutch. Um, I'm sure there's a couple things I'm missing. It's got a front mount on it. And yeah, it just loves to take the abuse. So we're going to head to the drag strip, see what it can do. I believe the last time when it was bone stock, it ran a 16.4. I'll have to go back and look. Um, hoping for around a... I'd be happy with anything in the 13. So we'll see what it does. So we rolled up to the PIR here. Braden's like, man, I missed this place. This is where he rides uh, motocross as well. We'll be racing motocross all summer long, so way over on the other side. But yeah, I'm gonna go check in. All right, get this sucker unloaded, go through tech. <coughs> all right, we here, baby. Pretty sweet truck over here. The left hand. So about ready to make my first hit. Uh, little info on the truck last time we were here. It made 200 horsepower and it ran a 16.4 in the quarter. So it's making a little less than 400 right now. Uh, we're on street tires, so we'll see what it does. I'm kind of counting on like a 14 something, maybe a 13, but we'll see. My buddy Nick out here hanging out. Uh, he's gonna be doing some filming on the exterior. I'm gonna be filming on the inside. So yeah, let's get to it. What's up, dude? What's up? Uh, what you gonna run? It ran a 16.4 with 200 horsepower, and now it makes 400. What's your guess on like, you know, by the end of the night? 400 and 500. 500 torque. But I mean, this thing is a five-speed manual, so the shifting may not be just buttery smooth. We'll see. But yeah. He's really uh, generous because it ain't going 12s, but anyways, we'll, we'll, we'll see. I'm going to guess 13.7 uh, myself. So, uh, yeah, we'll see. embarrassing uh time to throw the et streets on because we need to at least get into the 14s so uh but yeah i turned the boost up a little bit more keep in mind also this truck is 4500 pounds so it's not very light all right we got the freaking et streets on there they're 26s guys but that's kind of what i need with this gearing so should work 
we're gonna go make another hit and run like a like a 13 something how about that Challenger or whatever that thing was. Dang, dude. That thing was ripping off the line. That was impressive. Also, it only made like 12 pounds of boost, so try to turn it up a little bit more than that. Thank you, sir. Fourteen four. Ninety-four. Two one. 260 foot, not bad. 14.4. We're chewing it down. I wish it wouldn't cut out in fourth gear though, because it's not making the power that it's supposed to in fourth. So this last pass, fourth gear was cutting out. It's, it's missing. It's done this since I bought the truck. If you're wide open for like 15 seconds, you know, down the uh, racetrack, It'll cut out, you know, in fourth gear, or even when I'm drifting, uh, I'll be drifting for like 15 seconds. It'll start kind of cutting out. And if you kind of let off the throttle and smack it back, it's good to go for another 15 seconds. I don't know what's going on with it, but hopefully I figure it out. Time for another pass. Uh, that was like 12 pounds. So I clicked it one more. Hopefully it's, you know, 14, 15 pounds. So we'll see. Octane booster. It's not gonna fix it, but we're just gonna put it in because I'm sure it's it likes it. There goes 20 bucks. <laughs> but it did have this on the dyno. Let it run for a bit. BP works. Yeah. Brady says maybe the coils are heat soaking. We're taking the hood off. They just called last runs 15 minutes. There's nobody in staging lines. Well, we got to try it. with the hood off all the turbo flutter we go octane booster and no hood
But that definitely helped. That was like 13, 14 pounds. Dude. Come on, Betsy. eight at a hundred miles an hour flat four tenths five tenths half a second picked up the last round of octane booster and no hood on 13 eight at 100 miles an hour the last time i was racing this thing the clutch was bad so i was missing gears left and right and i haven't missed a gear yet and uh so yeah i've been having a lot of fun with this thing just banging gears in the old v6 truck uh new steering wheel Freaking 13 pounds of boost, let's go. I say this every time I go drag racing, but if you haven't gone, just go down to your local racetrack and go make some passes. It is so much fun. It doesn't need to be fast. This thing's not fast, but it's so much fun. 13.8, let's go. 2060 foot. 100 miles an hour, let's go! You yeah, boy! <laughs> yeah, so it was cutting out a lot less there. I think my previous best was 93? Something like that, so. Another seven miles an hour. Yes! Let's turn the boost up a little more. Oh yeah, I wouldn't worry about that little guy. Yeah, I cracked the freaking windshield with the hood. But dude! Yeah, that's funny, dude. It wasn't nearly as bad, it still did it a little tiny bit. Yeah, I feel like uh, you may have just said screw it and stayed in it, too. No, I was, I was in it every no. other time. That's freaking hilarious. 100% this hood, something's getting too hot. Because dude, yeah, it's gotta be it gained... It gained like six miles an hour. So let's turn it up some more. How much boost did it make that time? Uh, like 13. 13, I don't think it ever got above 15 uh, pounds of boost. But yeah, dude, 13.8? Yeah. 13.8 on 100 miles an hour. Not bad. My guess is 13.7. We're getting pretty close now. Oh, man. Last pass, here we go. They just shut it down, but then they let me go again. All you gotta do is tell them ice cream and they start actually working. Get it, baby! <laughs> get work, About time, boys. Get to work. Well, Nick, uh, thanks for coming out, dude. It was a good night. Yeah, Haven't appreciate it. It's been a while, so. Dude, he's got this sick supercharged Regal. Give it a little, give it a little something.
You can hear that roots blower from a mile away, boy. All right, that's going to do it for this one. We'll catch you on the next one.